Leonard Yor, we are back with some more of the J.D. Davidson, my career, and you can already see on your screen, it is time for the NBA draft, and we're just checking out some of the mock draft spots, and these are his projections before the draft lottery, and where we can actually see what team is going to get those coveted top 10 spots, right? Am I right or am I right? Now we're going to get into J.D.'s NBA comparisons. They say the ceiling is Eddie Johnson, the floor is Raymond Felton? That's crazy. <laughs> Strings says basically he can create his own shots. They say he's going to be an all-star sooner or later. Weaknesses is seeming it's going to be defense and yeah, just all defense, right? Now let's get into the actual draft lottery. And as you can see, the Kings get the number one pick. Rockets, number two, Thunder, three, Spurs, number four, number five is the Pistons. Number six is Magic. Number seven, the Hornets, eight, Pacers, nine, Blazers, and 10 is the Timberwolves. That is your lottery picks. And then after after that you guys can see what's going on jumping back on the mock draft and it's looking like they're predicting either JD could go to the Thunder or the 76ers either way both of those teams could use an explosive player like JD either coming off the bench or even starting maybe at the two spot but let's stop talking about it let's go ahead and be about it baby let's get into what we all came to see and that is the actual nba draft and first up is sacramento and of course they go for jabari that's cool next up they got aj griffin paulo bancaro chet oh we number five is johnny davis wow jalen duran gets picked up patrick baldwin damon collins damian collins i'm not even gonna mispronounce that young man's name Jaden hardy goes who else Jaden ivy goes Ben, all right. Don't know him. <laughs> Max Christie goes, okay. And then Nikola Jokic, that's, that is funny. And J.D. Davidson goes number 16 in the first round to the Chicago Bulls. They say Davidson showed tremendous athleticism at the draft combine with his 43-inch vertical, highest among all attending point guards. And we've seen that vertical IRL, and I am going to go ahead and change his name to the correct spelling as well as his cyber face. But this is what the rest of the draft looks like. Slow it down if you need to. You see my boy J.D. got updated on his face, etc. Let's get into his rookie contract, though. Two years 6.99 million dollars to jd davidson and that is amazing but you know we just can't leave it right there we gotta get into that summer league gameplay because y'all know just how i do it that <laughs> so let's stop talking about it let's be about it let's see what my boy looks like in this chicago bulls yes sir y'all already know what time it is baby <laughs> it's the summer league time you see the lineups you see jd Damn, we rocking a new number two, number 16 instead of number three. But it don't matter the number. Y'all know what we came here for. Sing it for me one time. Jump on, get it, get it. Jump on, get it, get it over. I'm excited to be here in the summer league in Vegas. Y'all already know. Wait a minute, JD. Ooh, we trying to get our first two points at the rim. But unfortunately, we get fouled. And you know we good for the throws. It is what it is, but let's get up. Ooh, we, okay. <laughs> I like that. Let's let's count that as our first two official points in the summer league. Why don't we, right? Pump fake, got him in the air, trying to see what we, hey, wait, hold on. Can we count that as our first two points? God damn. <laughs> 35 to 19 in Chicago. All right, hey, listen, getting destroyed, bro. I don't even know if that is the correct word, but the boys is getting violated right now. 35 to 22, and pretty much the summer league coach told JD, hey, my boy, <laughs> just do what you got to do. You know what I mean? It's, it's whatever at this point. You, you're losing. You're down this much. Go for it, right? Go for the gusto, and that's exactly what JD did. Look at my boy rising up. He got 16 punch, three boards. Well, make that four boards, two assists. And instead of that six foot three, my boy definitely is getting a lot of rebounds and you love to see. I don't know, man. I think that's like a common thing in the NBA. Look at the pull up. Oh, okay. Who knew he had it on him? I did. That catch and shoot out that corner, it's inevitable, right? That's the shortest three pointer you got in the game. And I know he doesn't have the best three point, but he can shoot it. He is confident shooting it. So let him pull it, right? 60 to 53. Nice little lob right there. And the Chicago boys are, are getting into a little run right now. And you, you love to see it, right? <laughs> Let's see if we can come away with the win, though, right? 
because the run, the points, the assists, they it, it's good. I'm not going to say it all means nothing because this is good to see. The young talents coming in, gelling with the old talents. Look at my boy, uh, come around. He missed that no need. Hey, put back. Oh, man. And Coach sits JD out for the rest of that game, but it was a great showing. Let's see how my boy can handle game two of the Summer League. Jumping right into game two of the Summer League. JD coming out with a mission, right? A little chip on his shoulder, chat. And y'all know I hope that chip is a Dorito. <laughs> right here, just getting his assist on. Like I said, we cannot just forget the fact that JD himself said he was a pass first point guard. So let's see my boy pass first. Two perks, two boards. Hold on. Attacking the rim. And we're getting a head start on New Orleans, unlike the first game. Throw me the lob. All right. The Chicago boys, they meshing. They're meshing very well. I, I have to say that because clearly the way they hooping right now is it, beautiful, bro. It's seamless, right? Whatever the summer league coach got going on with these young men, it's working. Especially that dude right there. I'm not even going to mispronounce his name, but a boy got the scrap on him, chat. If you don't believe me, it's not deja vu, chat. He really do that. Oh, got bars. Speaking of getting bars, hold on. What? JD pulled out the 360 dunk. Hey, hold on. You seen the scout report, boy. 43 inch vertical. You heard me? The highest in the draft combine. And he is definitely proving that. The 360 in the summer league. You know the media outlet is going to be talking about that. That's going to be ESPN top five. It's going to be number one. It's going to be top two and not two, right? <laughs> Getting the board right there again. Again, like I told y'all, look at the. Lord, just running the floor, so valuable. He's sneaky with the boards, man. He got nine of them, seven assists, and if they if the lane is wide open like that, I can't miss, right? And you can't miss the bottom left of your screen. Look at the score right now. <laughs> the Bulls, boy, Chicago Bulls is trying to run these boys out the gym. Now look, now fast forward. Why are we losing by two? Everybody clear the error. Set me this screen, wide open in the lane, don't touch me. Tying the game up with 22 seconds left. Coach said, let me see what you about. Let me see what that clutch gene about, JD. All right, then, 20 seconds left, 93 to 93. JD risking it for the double team, and unfortunately, it comes back to bite him. 95 to 93 with 13 seconds left. Calling for the isolation, calling for the play for Dostanumu. I hope that's how you pronounce his name because I'm trying to see his new moves. Oh, we bang. One point lead. Two seconds left. No timeouts. Do you believe <laughs> these Chicago Bull boys win it? And I hope you guys did enjoy this video, man. If you did, make sure you guys leave it a thumbs up, subscribe, turn on post notifications if you are new to the channel and you want to see some more NBA 2K content just like this. And I got you guys. But until the next one, man, ace. Oh, Lord. Running the floor. You love to see a 25, well, excuse me, 21, what, 23 perks, six boards, two assists. And it's early in his third, 59 to 52. And Jabari is not trying to see this lead dwindle because, like, I, I repeatedly keep telling y'all, man, the game is a game of runs.